Welcome to Lala Rink, Vermont's and Merrimack Hockey East action. Vermont picking up the victory 4-2 on Friday. It was the Catamounts' first league game. 0-2 in her career. This is her third start against the Catamounts. Puck is on the ice. We're underway. Vermont in the traveling green uniforms. Catamounts will work right to left in this opening period. Merrimack in their home whites. Navy in gold trim. Of course, from left to right. Chang works it. There's Lindbergh. Comes off the wall and fires it up high. Save made. Loose puck. Jam that. Score! Mary Edmonds tucked it in the short side. 48 seconds in. Merrimack on the board first. One nothing. Warriors. Take a look here. Lindbergh took the first shot. The blocker pad save. McPherson didn't know where the puck was. They continued to jam at it. Great opportunity for the Catamounts as Celine Tedenby brings the puck back down ice for the Warriors. Tedenby works the puck ahead as Vermont tries to slow that play down in the defensive zone. Warriors will get a quality opportunity. Score! Tedenby knocks it in. McPherson made the glove save. She dropped it in the crease, and Tedenby was there to knock it home. Two nothing Warriors. We'll take a look here. Oosterveld and Ferguson started the play. McPherson dropped it. Has it down low for the Catamounts. Lewis comes off the wall. Gets it back up on top. And moving in here is Tansky. Up on top for Levesque. Levesque goes cross ice. Malink of a shot. Save. Hogarth. Rebound. Score. Malenkova took the initial shot. A juicy rebound, and it's Rosemarie Brochu who scores for Vermont. And the Catamounts are on the board. 10-32 will be the time. Here you see back to the point. Levesque starting the play. Tic-tac-toe. The initial shot, and Brochu was there. Buck back out to center ice. Tara Blackburn with it. Her pass hit the skate of Hurst. Vermont trying to take advantage in transition the other way. Here's Humphrey. Bad angle shot blocked by Chang. Humphrey gets it back. Shot score. And we're tied. 4.07 of the third period. Lily Humphrey ties the game for the Catamounts. And that all started as a result of a broken play. There you see Humphrey. From the bad angle, the initial shot was blocked. She followed up her own miss, and she roofed it over Callie Hogarth. Over the line comes Mary Edmonds. Trying to slot it for McKinley. Vermont back in transition. Two on one. Beecher. Malinkova. She's in alone. Malinkova. And Hogarth with the save of the game. Vermont, however, looks like they may have gotten a piece of it, and they knocked it in. Hogarth looked like she made the initial save. But the loose puck was jammed in. Malinkova took the first shot. And it's going to be, it's going to be Malinkova. She banged in her own miss. We'll take a look at the replay here. The lead pass there. You see Malinkova going in alone. She tried the little deke. The save was made, but the puck rolled in. Catamounts attack. Brochu to Beecher. Back to Brochu. Brochu in front. Quick shot score. Kaylee Lewis. And it's been a three goal period for the Catamounts. Merrimack looked like they were a bit slow to react there. And Kaylee Lewis was there to finish off the play. That'll be goal number one for Lewis. Here you see the play develop. Brochu and Beecher both touch the puck. They'll both get assists. Eight seconds to go. Merrimack with a jam attempt. McPherson got a piece of it. Warriors going to run out of time here. And the Vermont Catamounts will sweep the weekend series as they're out to salute goaltender Jess McPherson. Catamounts with a 4-2 win today as they bookend the 4-2 win on Friday. And the Catamounts sweep here in North Andover this weekend.